Hey, thank you for tuning in. Um, do me a big favor. And if you're on a computer, click the red subscribe button below this video. If you're on a uh, phone or a tablet, just tap it with your finger. And um, yeah, I need, I'd like to get a lot more subscribers because I'd like to go be able to go live during the draft. So the only way I can do that is by you guys helping me. And, you know, I hope that you take that, you know, second or two to do so. So thank you. You guys are the best. And let's get into the video. What is up and welcome into the Wing T Big North football channel here on YouTube. Um, now, I've already done the most likely picks that I believe would uh, the, the Detroit Lions would select, uh, the players that they would select. But now we are going to get into what if they trade back uh, for teams that need quarterbacks. Teams like the Dolphins, the Jaguars, the Chargers, the Raiders, the Colts. Now... I really think that John Gruden is probably enamored enough with Justin Herbert that he would uh that he wouldn't mind trading his two ones and possibly a second and a third um, to jump up or maybe just the, the two ones and a second or the two ones and a third and jump up from 12 to three to grab Herbert because I believe that a lot of teams uh, that Herbert's impressed them. Um, also, there's that, you know, that young kid, Love. I know that a lot of teams are impressed by him. So, all right, with this version uh, of the NFL draft, the Detroit Lions have traded their third pick to the uh, Las Vegas Raiders for their 12th and 19th picks and a third round selection. And the Raiders select Justin Herbert and the Detroit Lions on the clock at 12. Select C.D. Lamb, wide receiver, Oklahoma. Now, C.D. Lamb, um, he's not the best route runner of the top group of three. Uh, that would be Jerry, Jerry Judy from Alabama. But I tell you what C.D. Lamb is. He is a player that he pretty much was the only receiver or receiving threat on Oklahoma last year. And boy, did he, I mean, he was just in beast mode from the first game. Uh, this guy catches everything that's thrown to him. Um, 
run after the catch can you know has decent has pretty good speed uh you know i was it was this i was going back and forth between him and judy and the only reason i picked uh cd lamb ab above jerry judy in this scenario is because jerry judy was playing with two other very good receivers uh, upper echelon, like, you know, top 20 picks. And CD Lamb, there wasn't one guy that you would draft in the first round out of uh, Oklahoma besides him. And I know that the Big 12 defense is optional, but I look, you know, I was looking at his bowl games and where he played those, you know, SEC teams and stuff. And his numbers are still, still there. I mean, you know, this guy produces. So we got Marvin Jones going into the last year of his contract. Um, I, I believe Kenny Galladay will probably get extended in the uh, in the off season here after the draft and all that. Um, so with that said, yeah, we have Galladay might trade Jones, might keep him, but we got Jones for the time being. And then C.D. Lamb is our third receiver. Um, who could easily be, uh, you know, one or two on any other team. So, yeah, with, uh, let me know what you think of this scenario. Drop your thoughts and your comments down below in the YouTube comment section. Thank you for watching. You guys are the best. Until next time, peace.